Scott Tales. Oh. <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. Excuse me. I. Uh, welcome to Scott Tales. My name is Scott Hostetler. And um, uh, you've come at a bad time. This is uh, cold and flu season, which has caught us here at the Scott Tail Studio. Everybody's down with a cough and a sore throat and, and, and congestion and everything. And, and uh, well, so we'll try to go on with the show. Uh, a guy says, Doc, can you help me? I can't stop my hand from shaking. He says, well, do you drink much? I said, uh, no, I can't even, I spill too much. <laughs> I'll try one more. Um, I call the nurse on the phone and I say, hello, I'm having trouble. I'm seeing spots before my eyes. She says, have you seen a doctor? And I thought for a minute and I said, no, just spots. <laughs> okay, a little better. You know what we need here is a shot of penicillin. Although I don't like shots, but we're going to try this new cocktail, new, meaning uh, new to Scott Tales, called the Penicillin. It was actually created in 2005 by Sam Ross, the famous milk and honey bar bartender in New York City, and it's named because of its medicinal uh, properties. The ingredients are said to relieve cold and flu symptoms, like there's honey, ginger, lemon juice, and whiskey. Sounds good to me. I mean, the ginger improves your immune system, and it has antibacterial properties. Now, honey is antibacterial, and it helps suppress coughs. Lemon juice has vitamin C in it, of course. Now, whiskey is a wonderful decongestant, and it's a good pain reliever for that sore throat. And we're going to garnish it with rosemary, which is antibacterial, antifungal, and antiviral. So um, we're going to make this Scott tail and hope it brings this to an end. We take our mixer, our shaker with some ice in it, and we're going to use Sam Ross's recipe. Some people use bourbon or rum or tequila or gin or vodka. We're going with what Sam Ross uses, which is two kinds of scotch, single malt scotch and blended scotch. <laughs> No, no questions, please. I'm oh my God. Okay, all right. One question. What is it? <clears throat> What's the difference between single malt and uh, blended whiskey, scotch whiskey? Okay, I will tell you. Uh, single malt is pure. It is made and bottled at one distillery. Now, blended scotch is made with frogs and snails and puppy dog tails. <laughs> but... <laughs> More accurately, it's made with uh, two kinds of whiskey, most likely a single malt and then mixed with another grain scotch whiskey. So that's the difference here. And we're going to use two ounces of blended whiskey. Now we are using Chavez Regal here from Scotland, 12 year old. It is 80 proof and it's, uh, it's a nice blended scotch whiskey. Then, for our uh, vitamin C, we're going to use three quarters of an ounce of fresh squeezed lemon juice. Put that right in the mix. Thank you very much. Now, but what are we going to do to boost our immune system? Well, we're going to use ginger syrup. Now, you can make ginger syrup, which is fine, but it's a lot of peeling and mashing and steeping and just, I got this wonderful farm fresh ginger syrup from Hanalei Distiller Distilleries in Hanalei Bay, uh, Kauai, and it is fabulous. They make wonderful uh, spirits and things from the farm. So we've got a half an ounce of ginger syrup, then we are going to, to help soothe our throats, use half an ounce of honey syrup. How do you make honey syrup? You know how to make it. You take uh, two tablespoons of honey, two tablespoons of warm water in a smart, small jar, shake them up, you have honey syrup. Voila! Now we are going to put the lid on that little feller and give it a little shaky poo. You know, I was working at a bookstore, 
And this guy comes in and says, hey, do you have any audio books with subtitles? And I said, well, that would be a book. <laughs> Some pit bull. Oh, boy, I hope this works because I really need to feel better. I've got Scott Tails people coming over and they're going to want to have Scott Tails. And okay, now we have our drink, but it's not done yet because we're going to add that rosemary. And then the way Sam Ross makes it is you use half or a quarter of an ounce of a single malt scotch whiskey float. You pour it in slow, over the top, just like that. We're using Shield Ag 18-year-old single malt scotch whiskey. It was uh, a lovely, lovely gift. Now, it's already been shaken. The float goes through it because we want to drink through it. Should we give it a try? I hope it works. Yes! Boy, that is good. That's better than a shot, that's for sure. I can feel it working already. W O W. That that is fantastic. I feel great. I feel like a hundred bucks. Boy, that is the way to go. I feel so good I might go back to my doctor. Had a bad experience last time. He told me I needed to lose weight. I said, well, how? He said, well, don't eat anything fatty. I said, well, what, pizza, a pie, cake? He said, no, I, what I meant was don't eat anything fatty. <laughs> hmm, I resemble that remark. Anyway... As we say here on Scott Tales, get yourself some penicillin and then drink up because it's almost closing time somewhere.